welcome to my channel. My name is Missy and as always, I'm so happy that you're joining me today. I do hope you're having a fantastic day. If you're new here, welcome. And uh, I do hope that you stick around and subscribe. I would love to have you as part of my YouTube family. And if you already do subscribe, thank you from the bottom of my heart. And uh, it does not go unnoticed and I love you all. So I went to Dollarama. Now I have been sick for a little while uh, and I'm on the mend and uh, I was really missing doing a haul. So uh, I went to Dollarama yesterday and I went to two different Dollaramas and uh, I think I got some pretty good stuff. So let's get to and I'll show you what I got from Dollarama. So the first thing that I picked up and this will be for a giveaway. Um, I will announce the giveaway in the next uh, video that I do. But uh, I thought this was so cute, and uh, it was $1.25, and I love this bag. It just looks like a little purse. Love the shape of it, love the color, and I did get this down the Easter aisle, and uh, had to bring it home, of course. So, while I was getting ready this morning, I had set a few things out here, um, just so I wouldn't forget them, and uh, this was one of them, and this is for my daughter. And I believe this was $2 and it's a Rockstar Punched. And uh, as it was sitting here, Theo thought he would open it. Um, this is not something that I would try uh, for you because I don't like energy drinks. But uh, he did open the tab and uh, it's my daughter's and she will drink it when she gets home. You can't leave any cans around him. He will open it so quick it's not even funny. And he did wake up on the wrong side of the perch this morning. Uh, Theo is in quite a mood today. So, uh, well, we all, we all wake up like that sometimes, and uh, I think it was because it was so gloomy this morning, and now the sun's out, and maybe he'll be a little bit more happier. So, the next thing I got was $1.75, and I had not seen these at uh, any of my Dollaramas before, and it's a waffle bowl. I was so happy to see these. Uh, you get six bowls, and um, it's just really nice to have ice cream in, or um, sometimes I make brownies with ice cream. Just a really nice uh, waffle bowl. And uh, I was really happy to see that Dollarama had those. And they were on the end of the food aisle. Um, I almost missed them. I just turned the aisle and they were right there. And they had tons of them. So, the next thing I got, nothing is in order. It's all the way that uh, the girl put it in my bag. The next thing is a silicone... Um, beauty blender and I had not seen these before either and uh, I do not have my receipts I lost them <laughs> I don't know where they are but I think this was about three dollars and uh, my daughter said she has used these before and she really likes them so we're going to give that a try next time I do my makeup the next thing that I bought, and I have seen these many times at Dollarama, but I have never tried them. And uh, they were a dollar, and they're the vegetable crackers. And uh, I do like a vegetable cracker, and uh, there's six, six packs in here, so they're individually packed, and we are going to try those today. And uh, the next thing I got with some more of these uh, rice cakes with the uh, chocolate. And I'm not sure if I tried those before, but I am gonna give them another try today. Uh, they get hauled all over YouTube and, uh, for, and rightfully so. They are amazing, absolutely amazing. The, oh, I got two of those. The next thing I bought, I have seen hauled too, and I was so happy to see it uh, at my Dollarama yesterday. And uh, it is a Lidware collapsible food storage container. And I think this is absolutely wonderful. Really wonderful. Um, they only had the one size, but uh, you know, it goes like that. And then you just pop out the bottom to make it bigger. How wonderful is that? Save a lot of room in your fridge. Can't wait to use that. The next thing I got, um, I don't think it's uh, an amazing price at Dollarama. It's probably the same as the grocery store, but I happen to be at Dollarama, so I picked them up for the cat, and they're the Temptations, and they were $3.50. And uh, she likes the purple bag, which is the dairy one, but they didn't have that one, so this is her next favorite, and it's the chicken. $3.50 for that. 
The next thing I got, and I'm going to try these for you, are Rocklets and they're peanut flavored. And I had not seen these before either. And uh, I'm excited to try these. I'm really excited. And then I bought a uh, Frappuccino. Did I say how much they were? They were, uh, I need my glasses. $1.50. $1.50 for those. And uh, this was $2.50. And it's the uh, vanilla Frappuccino. And I, I'm not sure if I tried this one. I think I tried the um, mocha one. So we're going to give this a try. Um, I love all of them anyways. They're just so, so good. $2.50 for that. The next thing I got, my husband asked me to pick up because uh, when we lose our power here, we like to have lots of um, flashlights around. And I have lots of candles burning as well. But uh, the candles can be dangerous to the birds. So uh, if they're still up, we like to use flashlights instead. And uh, these were $4 each, I think. Sorry, I don't have my receipt. But I got two of them. Um, now, they are cheaper if you buy a bigger package at Canadian Tire, but he just asked me to pick up a couple of those, so I did. And uh, I'll give those to him. The next thing I got, I thought was just so cute, and this was $4, and it's a Home Sweet Home uh, door stopper. And I thought this was really sweet. They had different ones there. It wasn't the one I was going in for, so... Um, uh, I will still be on the lookout for the one that I want, but uh, I thought this was really sweet. Yes, we like that. The next thing that I bought uh, is a brand name. It's Biore, and uh, it's a cleansing micular water, and uh, it's great for combination skin and uh, blue agave and baking soda. And this removes your makeup. And uh, I'm all about uh, something to help me get my makeup off at night. The last one I bought at the dollar store uh, in my other haul was amazing, but I couldn't find it again. But I did find this, and this was uh, $4 as well. Yes, happy to have that. And I'll try that out and let you know how it is. The next thing I got, um, I, I noticed yesterday they're restocking the makeup aisle, which makes me very happy. This is another brand name, and uh, it's wonderfully real, and it's Rimmel, and it is a mascara. And uh, I have a certain brand that I like, but uh, my daughter really likes this one, so I picked this up, and I believe that was $4 as well. It was 3 or $4. But uh, that will be going to my daughter. And the next thing that's going to my daughter was uh, I believe $4 as well and it's the Baked Illuminating Duo by Hard Candy another brand name so happy to see that I did haul um, a blush one and I absolutely love it um, I use that I think it's just uh, wonderful so I'm gonna give this to her because she's uh, more experienced with makeup and I asked her if she would use that and she said oh yes absolutely so I'll give that to her but uh, yeah, they're, they're restocking their makeup aisle. I'm happy. I love to see it. The next thing is a repurchase. Um, last haul, I um, hauled these Lady Sarah chocolate wafers. And you know that I like them. I did the happy dance. And uh, they are all gone. And I absolutely love a wafer. Uh, at nighttime with my tea, um, I have a couple of these. And uh, they're just really, really good. So if you see those, pick them up. They're wonderful. Yes. The next thing I got, I have seen hauled, and uh, I had a hard time finding it, but I found it yesterday, and I bought two of them. And it's the, I don't know how you pronounce it, I think it's Phyto Paris Shampooing Hydrating Brilliance. This was $4, and on Amazon, I believe, I looked it up this morning, and I think it was um, $17.99 or something like that. So that's what it looks like out of the box. And uh, it smells wonderful. It almost, I think it's got coconut in it. Mm, lovely. I can't wait to try this. You know, I've told you before that I've had breakage with my hair. And my hair's just went through a lot this uh, winter. So uh, I'm always ready to try a new product. Now, I do like the Hask products, but I'm having a hard time finding them now. So I might have to move on to something else that I can find. And uh, what a great deal for $4. Yes. 
You're saving $13 by buying it at the dollar store. So, the next bag. Now, I saw these and I thought they were just wonderful. And they were $1.25 and they're reusable bags. And this one caught my eye. You know I love my birds. And I thought this was so bright and just reminded me of spring. And uh, yeah, so we brought that one home. And then this one I thought was just absolutely beautiful. I love the teal color. And uh, I love a reusable bag. We do not have plastic here on PEI. So uh, reusable bags are um, what we use. And um, I like using something with a nice pattern or something like that. And uh, I thought this was just lovely. Yes, $1.25. And they had all different ones there. They had these two. They had, I think, the Ocean. Um, I can't remember the other ones, but they had about four or five different kinds. And there's the other uh, shampoo that I bought. And then um, I found another vegetable cracker there. Now, I hadn't seen it in my Dollarama. Um, but uh, anyways, I picked this up. And uh, I think it's made by the same people that make these. And, uh, and that's what they look like. And they also have, uh, I, think it, I think there's six packages in here too. We'll know when we open it. But uh, I'm anxious to try them. They fit right into uh, my eating, uh, my calorie counting, I should say. The next thing I got um, is a product of Italy, and uh, I've seen these many, many times there. They were $1.50, and they are the Swiss Rolls. And uh, I thought I would give those a try today as well. Yes, love a Swiss Roll. The next thing I had not seen at my Dollarama either, and they had green apple, and then they had the berry cherry, and it's the Jelly Belly um, Bubble Bath. And uh, I'm super excited to try this. My daughter was excited to see it there. Um, I had, like I said, not seen it there before. And uh, the green apple smelled really nice. And I'll probably get that one next time. But this one smells divine. It really does. And I love a good bubble bath. Yes. Smells wonderful. Can't wait to use that. The next thing I got, they finally got them in. And uh, they are the Relax Blueberry and Vanilla Bath Bombs. And they were, I think, $1.50. Yes, $1.50. And I've hauled these before. And they're everyone's favorite in the house. Um, we have gone through many bath bombs. Uh, but uh, these are our favorite. They are wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. Okay, the next thing I got is a Phyto product as well. And uh, it's Curl Legend and uh, Curl Energizing Spray. And uh, I looked this up and I believe it was about, uh, I want to say around $13 on Amazon. So again, what a great deal. So if you see this and uh, you like your curly hair, uh, hopefully this works. I'm going to try this and let you know because I do have very curly hair. I straighten it and then recurl it most of the time. But uh, I might give this a try and just let my curls be natural. And uh, I'll let you know how that goes. And uh, that was $4 as well. The next thing I got, I bought one of these about a month ago and I cannot find it. Um, I'm thinking maybe it either fell out in the car or I left it at Dollarama, but this was $4 and I've seen these hold as well. And it's the wireless charging pad. And uh, I uh, have lost my wall plug for my phone. Um, just losing things all over the place I am. But uh, I do believe that is in the car because um, I took the whole charging unit out, took that off and plugged the uh, other part into the car. And now I can't find the plug in part. So we're going to give this a try. My husband was very intrigued. He said if it works that he wants to have one as well. And uh, I've never used a charging station before, but I can't wait to try this. Yes, very excited about that. The next thing I got was the Hask conditioner. I cannot find the shampoo anywhere, and I'm very, very sad about that. But, um, you know, it, that's the way it is at Dollarama. You find a good product, get it then because it could be gone. But this is the conditioner. I have hauled this before, and this is really helping my hair. And, um, yeah, I think I have about three or four of these, and I think I might have one shampoo left. But um, 
again if you see this pick it up this is fantastic and it goes for over twenty dollars on amazon so the shampoo does anyways so the next thing i got um i got to eat yesterday i was starving i didn't go to dollarama until later in the afternoon and i had not eaten all day I didn't plan that, it's just the way that it happened to work out. So I bought a pepperoni stick and um, forgot all about it in the bag. But uh, these are fantastic. And uh, they're Shopsies, I'm sure you've probably had them before. And uh, yes, wonderful. The last thing that I have to show you before I do a taste test is uh, in the last haul I did, I had uh, the plant that's over there, the uh, artificial plant and planter. And uh, I said I was going to go back and get the bonsai tree. Now, I did buy it at my local Dollarama, but the ones I saw in Summerside were um, different. They seemed a little bit bigger, but uh, it does not matter. I love this anyways, and this was $4. And it's just so darn cute. And uh, yes. And, uh, you know, from a distance, you cannot tell that this is uh, fake. And I just love the little stones here. And uh, I might go back and get my uh, daughter one for her room. But absolutely love this. I think it's just so sweet. Yes. And I cannot keep a plant alive. So uh, that's the best kind of plant for me. So I'm going to go and clean up and come right back with the taste test. Okay, I'm back. I've cleaned my mess up somewhat. Um, I'm going to try the drink first. And like I said, I think I might have tried this one before. But these are amazing. Mm, I love it. Oh, this is so, so good. If you have not tried these, grab yourself one at Dollarama. They are amazing. I don't have a favorite. I like the mocha one just as much as I like the vanilla one. So next we're going to try these um, Rocklets. Now I like an M&M peanut, um, so we'll try these and see if they're, they're any good. And that's what it looks like in the bag. Mmm. 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 These are good. These are dangerous. They taste different than the M&Ms, of course, but um, they are really, really good. Hiding them. Hiding them. Yes, they'll be gone tonight if I put those on the counter in the kitchen. So I will hide them for me. Um, the next thing we'll try are the rice cakes. And you do get six of them in here. And these are a wonderful treat. And they are 80 calories for one, which is perfect for my calorie counting. And uh, it's going to break a piece off. Mmm. Mmm. Yum. Hands down, one of my favorite snacks from Dollarama. Hands down. Love them. Absolutely love them. So, these are the vegetable crackers that I paid a dollar for, and they're individually wrapped. And you get five crackers. And that's what it looks like. Mmm. Yum. Mmm. 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 I was not expecting that. I thought it would be plain. This is salted to perfection, and it's not too um, too much of a vegetable flavor. This is fine, and I was thinking, you know, maybe some cream cheese or something on here. It's perfect by itself. Mmm. I love to be surprised. I absolutely love it. So, we've tried that one. Let's try the next one made by the same company. 
Okay. They're all wrapped individual. You just throw that right in your purse. Yes, you could. Mmm. If I can open it. Okay. So you get three in each package, and that's what they look like. Mmm. Mmm. I don't know which one's my favorite. I like them both. Mmm. This has a fantastic flavor. Yes. And I can throw them in my purse, like I said. All right, I'm having a vegetable platter this afternoon. So I'll put a few of these on there. This is amazing and so reasonable to buy. And I love how thin they are. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. So one pack, which is three crackers, is 60 calories. Yes. Mmm. The other ones are, are buttery. Um, these ones are very vegetable-y, and I like that. I like the vegetable flavor uh, in these. I really, really do. So, so good. We're doing so well. Yay. Mmm. So the next thing is... Um, the Swiss rolls, the last thing actually, and uh, they were $1.50, and uh, they're individually wrapped. So far, all their little cakes are so good from Dollarama. I'm just going to cut a little piece off. That's what it looks like inside. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh, I need another piece. I feel a happy dance coming on. The chocolate. Sometimes when I buy Swiss rolls, I think the chocolate kind of tastes um, very flat, very fake. The chocolate on this is amazing. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Here it comes. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love them. I don't know if that's a good thing. <laughs> the chocolate is amazing on them. They are really wonderful, wonderful Swiss rolls. Um, I like them, like I said, better than uh, Vashon or... Um, Little Debbie, they are wonderful. Love the chocolate. It's good chocolate. And they are from, I think, Italy. Yes, from Italy. So uh, if you like a Swiss roll, uh, pick yourself up a package of these at Dollarama for $1.50. And that's all I have for you today. I hope you have the best day. And uh, if you like this video, please subscribe and hit the like button. Until next time, bye for now. Thank you.